sure looked good on paper. But who's gonna help you make sure it looks good on stage? This is Wild Chronicles. I'm Boyd Matson. Across the continent of Africa, rain is often the signal for crocodiles to move. Young crocs, even those that have recently hatched, will use the new channels to seek out territory of their own. Sometimes they can travel dozens of miles to find a good water hole or a relatively safe stretch of river. Even at eight years old and eight feet long, an adolescent crocodile must still steer a cautious course. Her education is far from over. By now she's large and fast enough to catch fish as soon as they dare to swim near her snout. She's too big to fear even a Goliath heron. But a hippo can crush a young crocodile in his jaws. She's still far too small to intimidate a lion. But one day, they might be competitors. As with any adolescent, the temptations are many and the opportunities very few. But the young crocs here are learning another key lesson, to seize every opportunity. These carmine bee eaters had built their nests deep in the riverbank. They're returning with food for their chicks. Below, the young crocodiles can do little more than hope a youngster takes a fatal tumble. but other predators don't have to wait. The nemesis of all hatchlings, the monitor lizard, knows exactly when the hunting is good. All the crocs can do is watch. Perhaps their old enemy will drop a chick, or better yet, slip and become a meal itself. It's a frustrating way to learn the value of patience. But as it crawls from nest to nest, the croc's old foe becomes an unwitting ally. Soon it triggers a chain reaction. The wall, already loosened by rain and drought, starts to crumble. It's disaster for the bee eaters, but a bonus for patient predators. A black kite swoops in, knocked from their nests the chicks have no hope of rescue. Their fluttering helps seal their fate.
for a crock, a beater is barely a snack. But even the leftovers are worth a fight. It's one more meal, one more lesson in what it takes to survive. Check for Wild Chronicles on your local PBS station. Sponsored by National Geographic Mission Programs. Taking science and exploration into the new millennium. Additional support provided by Lindblad Expeditions. Celebrating five decades of exploration to the wildest places on Earth.